Keith Young here with a real quick tutorial to show you how to use Audacity to record the system audio on your PC, the internet radio, or any sounds that are playing through your computer. I'm doing this tutorial because I saw a few people having a hard time with it and I was able to figure it out using the latest version of Audacity which I believe is 2 point something. I just downloaded it last night and uh, I was able to figure it out so I figured I would do a real quick tutorial just to share with the community. What you need to do in order to make this work is activate the sound control panel. Now there's a couple ways you can do it. The first way you can do it is to go down to your taskbar and if you have the speaker down here that's active you can control your speaker from this area. Right click on the speaker and then choose sounds. Now if you don't have that speaker active in your taskbar area, what you are going to need to do is go to your control panel and then activate the sounds control panel from there. So you can activate the sound control panel from this area as well. So there's a couple ways you can do that. The most important part of this is you need to go to the recording tab, right click in a blank area here, and then choose show disabled devices. What you need to do is when stereo mix pops up, right click on stereo mix and choose enable. This needs to be enabled in order for you to record the system audio on your PC and Audacity. Once that's enabled, go ahead and click OK. From here, once you're in Audacity, uh, I've chosen the MME settings, and for the microphone, you need to choose Stereo Mix. That's very important. It won't record uh, the Microsoft Sound Mapper or anything else. And uh, by default, this area may even be blank if you do not have a microphone attached to your computer. So you need to make sure you have Stereo Mix selected or this will not work. The next thing you need to do is that we're going to go ahead and test this. I'm going to turn on uh, internet radio station that I already have up and activated. So I'm just going to turn this on. To be released from the hospital. And then I'm going to click record. Yes, we are live at Henry Ford Hospital. This is where the officers were rushed to. People have been coming and going all night long. Members of the Detroit Police Department, relatives. Okay, so while that was recording, you actually saw the left and right uh, monitors going up and down. So we were actually able to record some sound. The waveform, it looks like it didn't come in very clearly so that you can actually see the waveform. But you can see, once again, these monitors are going up and down, uh, which indicates that the sound actually did record. So if I just turn up my speakers here, oh, I'm sorry, uh, that's not the speaker. If I turn up my volume on the uh, speakers here, then I'll be able to hear what I recorded. But uh, pretty much that is the process for recording the system audio for using Audacity. Hopefully this tutorial helped. Uh, I am not an Audacity expert by any means, but uh, I felt like I could share uh, something I was able to discover with the community. Hopefully this helps, and I wish you well on your endeavors. Once again, this is Keith Young, and I'll see you next time.